So today is an exciting day because it is the NHL Stanley Cup Final Media Day. So we just got our credential. We're about to head in. We're doing coffee break live from Ball Arena. So let's get inside. Not allowed to show the credential. I'm gonna show the lanyard because Stanley Cup Final. This is, it's so exciting. Oh, I'm so excited. But now we gotta go park somewhere else. There was literally a sign that was like, if you show your ID on, or your credential on social media, they will take it from you. So maybe after this is all over, I'll show you. But let's get inside. For media day though, we are, so we're doing coffee break live from ball. After that, they're doing morning skate for both of the teams. And then they're also doing booths. So we're hoping to get some fun content and just have fun with the guys. Um, it's just really exciting. T-Mac photobombed like, us. I mean, We're excited to be I'm here. We hope you guys are super excited about the Stanley today. Cup final. D-Mac's excited for free lunch. We're all excited to be here. We're back here tomorrow morning oh, yeah. at Ball Arena for coffee break. For sure you come hang out with us. Thank you everybody so much. And we will see you tomorrow. <laughs> I got you. I got you. I got you. Come on. Will hopped on for trivia. Hey, what up? Jake and I, we did it here. I'm right across. Live right. from the Stanley yeah. Cup final. Ball like arena, baby. Woo -woo. We're all lost. We don't know where we're going. I don't understand. Like, everyone's following us now. I don't. Oh, all the cameras are going this way, so that's okay, why I'm going this I'm way. I'm following the cameras too. Yeah. You yeah. know, we're all lost. Well, it's they, fine. they changed all where all the normal locations are for yeah. games. We'll okay. find it. We'll find Joe Sackick. We're looking to be throwing the champs, I guess. In the last couple of years, I think it's made us uh, a stronger group, a more resilient group. I was in, uh, had a mission uh, from the start to try and get home ice advantage, and it was similar. You know, with this. So this is where all the players, all the networks are doing all of their stuff. So there's going to be podiums over there for all the players. ESPN, I'm pretty sure, is right behind us. Or no, NHL Network right behind us over here. Stanley Cup is right there. Stanley Cup. Dude, the Stanley Cup is right there. Let's go. Right there. Hockey Challenge Cup. to get in the Stone Cup final is uh, cherry on top of it. And this is the media squirm for Nate McKinnon. Insane. Do you know all the words? Uh, I mean, I'm sure I can sing the main chorus that the fans sing and stuff like that, but I don't know if I can go for the whole song. So. success what you guys think Ooh, okay that was my question was it crazier than you thought or yes kind yes. of what you had on par I mean that's hockey like you don't see crowds like this for hockey yeah but that's the Stanley Cup we haven't had that here in 21 years it was so. a ton of fun though we didn't, we didn't know yeah. what it, I've been to a couple Super Bowls it wasn't quite the same as a Super Bowl yeah but it wasn't that far behind it was pretty nuts it also isn't as in as big of a room for the Super Bowl so it felt more crowded it, it, it was basically the all-star game of course field last year without 20 pounds of sweat on you because they were doing all that outside and oh yeah thank goodness what, it was July? inside yeah. so. I'll take it being inside but we're headed to lunch now. Let's see what they're serving. Are we getting lucky today or what? They're carving meats for us. And a dessert table. Yum. Thank you. They've got the mood lighting. We got pasta salad, some like roast beef, bread, and then they've also got a dessert table for us. Cheers to the Stanley Cup final. I love desserts. Oh my gosh. On first impression. It's a dessert shooter according to Jake Shapiro? Yep. 
delicious. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm gonna try this. Yep. Kidney. <laughs> oh my god. It's Is really it good? good? It's really good. <laughs> this is not what I expected at all. No, I'm mad about this. Lunch is done. Tampa Bay is on the ice now practicing, so we're gonna watch this for a little bit and then we'll head to like the podium thing and do it all over again like we did for us. Look at how many sections they took out for media members. That is so much. We are sitting in section 126. This is how close we are to the glass. And we just looked up ticket prices. Section 126, row four, which is where Will and I are. $1,700. Now for us to go down to row one. $3,500. Or $5,700. I'll take sitting right here for four grand. Yeah. Can I get like $200 no. off in the fifth row back here? Or? <laughs> I don't think it's worth it. I don't think it's worth it to spend an extra four grand to sit four rows close. Literally. Oh, just me. I mean, that's it. Like, here's my hand. Right there. Fifty-seven hundred. No, thank you. General Manager Julian Brisebois and Head Coach John Cooper here to take your questions. You We're waiting for the players, but the main difference that I've noticed so far is it seems very been there, done that for Tampa Bay. Like they're very cool, collected, but it's very buttoned up business for the ass. So it's like the difference that I noticed between the two pressers and kind of what we've seen so far. Also, definitely not as much media here for Tampa Bay. It's just nice now. That's a wrap on the Stanley Cup Final Media Day. It was a lot of fun. Cool seeing the different vibes. Like I mentioned, the biggest takeaway for me was how been there, done that it felt for Tampa Bay and how business buttoned up it was for the Avs. Um, we did some fun social videos that you guys will see, so make sure you follow everybody at 1043thefan.com. And we're back tomorrow night for game one. We'll also be at morning skate. So love you all. We'll see you in the next one.